friends today we are going to make our website smart smart in the sense that it will act according to user action and our requirements and for this we will use if statements in if statement we check a condition and here we check a test condition and if condition is true then we execute all the code inside these curly braces and if that condition is false not true then this code will not be executed this is the flow chart of if statement here you can see first we will check a condition if that condition is true then we will process something otherwise we will skip that if statement here i will put it at the top now i will click on local host when i will click on submit order then here you can see our order is processed but we have not ordered anything as total item order are zero and we want to make sure that only to process order if something is ordered by the user so for this we will use if statement here i will put if statement and then i will make a test go to php statement and click on if and in these parentheses i have to put the test condition and i am checking if total quantity equal equal to 0 that user has not ordered anything then we will print you did not order anything on previous page and order will not be processed i will commit out this rest of the code with multi line commits now i will save it now i will click on local host now when we i will submit here you can see you did not order anything and our order is not processed here i will put some styling i will embed it in paragraph and i will style color of text red now i will save it now i will run and here you can see its color is also changed so we are checking if user has not ordered anything then it will not process order but if user has ordered anything then it should process and for this we have if else statements and in if else statements if condition is true then this block of code will be executed but if condition is not true then else part will be executed and this is the flow chart of if statement if condition is true then this block of code will be executed if condition is false then this block of code will be executed we are going to do the same in our web development here i will remove multi line commits here i will write else and i will put this code inside this else curly braces here now if we will order anything it will be processed otherwise this will be displayed now i will submit order as you can see you did not order anything now i have ordered something and here you can see we have successfully calculated and our order is processed so this is the structure of if else and you can use these statements in your web development according to your requirement that's it for today's lecture we will learn about php concepts in our upcoming lectures and we will develop our website as well thank you for your time